guys. I'm Ebony reporting for RPTV. I'm here today at the Daniel Spectrum Farmer's Market. Let's go check it out. With the RPTV reporters. The Regent Park Farmer's Market launched as a pilot project last June as a new kind of farmer's market for Toronto. The Regent Park Farmer's Market runs every Wednesday through the summer to the end of September, 3.30 p.m. to 7 p.m. Hello, my name is Shania and I'm at the Farmer's Market with Kara. Hello Kara, how are you today? I'm great, how are you? I'm really good. Okay, so uh, what do we have here? Uh, so my company is called Spark Plug Coffee and I have fresh roasted coffee in beans in bags and in jars and then I have some ice, it's actually it's cold brewed coffee, so cold coffee. Okay, so why do you think the farmer's market is so important? For people who live in a really urban environment like this, it's really important to have access to produce that is not, um, yeah, that's, that's local and where we don't have to go to the grocery store for things that have been warehoused and shipped all over the, the country. The defining feature of the market was the inclusion of resident chefs from the local community, as well as musical performances and artistic activities by local talent. So I'm here with Raymond. So Raymond, what do you do here? I'm actually with the Toronto Christian Resource Center, which is a program just up the street at uh, 40 Oak Street. And uh, we have a um, drop-in center there. And today we're actually um, part of the farmer's market, which we've been part two times before. We have a music program that um, we go out there and anybody's welcome to come and basically jam with us. So we'll learn your music, you learn ours. And then I go out there and find community gigs, which is at the, like here, we played at Cabbage Town Festival. And uh, we also do breakfasts and lunches for people and all kinds of great work. So come on by for a tour at 40 Oak Street at Parliament in Dundas. So Hey, Richard Park, how are you guys doing today? Uh, today we are at Farmer's Market and collaborating for a summer series is Sage Turtle. Today I am running the Story Circle at the Farmer's Market in Regent Park. So can you tell us how did you become a storyteller? I was telling a story to my uncle which I thought was amazing and he was the kind of guy who walked in the room and everybody just flocked to him fantastic storyteller and even though he was a great storyteller he was a terrible person and he said I hate this story and I can't listen to it for one more second so uh, I gathered up all my teenage courage and I said how would you tell it and he told it back to me and I realized that storytelling was an art that you can learn instead of a talent that you're born with all right guys this is Ebony signing off for RPTV see you guys next time